DoorDash delivery. Mama delivery. DoorDash delivery. DoorDash mama delivery. It might not sound right, but okay. I love you. Hi, y'all. So, today, the scene is way different. We are not at home. We are at mother's house. Say hi, mama. Mm-hmm. She said hi. She said, mm-hmm. Okay. So, in the comment section below, say hi to mama. Uh, let them know that you are watching and all that good stuff. So I went to Target and I I found a uh, a bunch of stuff, but that did all this one on my list. I'm going to show y'all what my list really looked like. This was my list. I had to write it really sloppy um because um I was in a rush to go and to leave. I hear the weather in Dallas is it's cold outside. Yesterday it felt so good, y'all. And today it's like cold. It's um in the forecast supposed to rain and it th it's a, a flash flood warning threat. So yeah, we got some things going on over here in Dallas. But anyways, um yes, I'm at mom's house. Um so intentionally I was supposed to go and buy Ashton some lunch stuff for his lunch because we do make his lunch for school. Nobody got time for that school lunch, if y'all know what I mean. And plus, it's always good to know that your kid is eating good and healthy food and food from home. Um, so this is all the stuff that I bought. Y'all, I didn't go in there to spend money, nothing like that, but it happened. I spent like $120, $25. I'm going to say that $120, $25 up in Target's. Some of this stuff was on clearance, um, and then a couple of these items I talked down uh, at the register because they had some little scratching marks on them, um, and then I found some things that was in the clearance section, and when I took it to the register, um, they were saying it was the regular price, but obviously, if it's in the clearance section, you definitely can talk it down. I did use my digital cartwheel rewards. I do encourage all my moms, fathers out there, because we do have some dads out there that take care of their kids, to download that uh, Cartwheel app from Target because it do uh, give you a percentage back on your Cartwheel. I had, I, I think I used like $10 on my Cartwheel um, digital. Um, but yes, I did use $10 of my Cartwheel um, cash. Um, and then I also had like a um, another gift card that I had and I added it to it and then I used it so that's what made this the total go down um initially the <laughs> the total was like $138 but using my Cartwell app um that digital um cash and then using the gift card that I had brought it down so I was really excited so anyways let's get into the um haul so I got my son, they only had uh, one of these and I was looking for the turkey one, but they didn't have the turkey. So, so they didn't have uh, the turkey one, but I did get him one of these. Um, Ashton loves these right here. They're really quick, simple, especially if, when he's at school. He See, he's in the fifth grade, so he eats like around one. I'm not sure how it works in other cities, but um, here they eat like Fifth graders eat like around one o'clock. <clears throat> so he'll have like a little lunch before that because uh, these kids be hungry. So I got him some of the uncured ham and Kobe cheese lunch kit. And then it has like little cookies in them as well. And then I got him one of the regular Lunchables. It's the same thing, ham and American cheese crackers with um, chocolate cookie with cream in it it's more like an oreo um so i got him both of those but normally to save money to stay on budget i get him these because they're more cheaper they're like a dollar 99 um, compared to these they're very expensive so <clears throat> i stick with these um and i also i definitely sometimes 
I do not get him the ham one. I get him the turkey one because we don't really eat like ham meat and stuff like that. So I got him the, um, this because that's all they had. Okay, let's move it along. So I got him some of these jumbo blueberries. Um, Mom came up with this good idea. Instead of giving chips or like snack cakes, put fruit into like little, and I forgot to get so many Ziploc bags for the snacks. But um, you can buy some, uh, either you can buy like the sandwich Ziploc bags, but the snack ones will be best. Uh, put some of these in the mini snacks uh, bags and portion them out and put them in the refrigerator for if you want to put them in their lunch bag for school or when they come in, they can just grab it and have a snack on hand. So we definitely um, got him some of these. And these are the Target brand, Good and Gather. So Target brand is my favorite brand because it's more cheaper. Target's itself is expensive. Y'all already know it. So <laughs> any little deal that I can get on like the app, the digital app, I will definitely get it. Um... I do. I did get some of this ultra thin deli slices. This is also by Good and Gather, Target's brand. Some of the smoked honey turkey. Surprised that they had this on deck because um, they normally sell out of this. And then also, I was looking for the bigger pack. If you were wondering, they do have a bigger pack, but I think you have to go into the Super Targets um, and <clears throat> grab that. I was just in the smaller version Targets, so they had what they had, and I just went ahead and grabbed some. So he got two of these. <clears throat> After you get through with this little container, you can use this container for um, to put in your kids' lunch uh, bags um, for their sandwiches, um, put for their snacks. And what'd you say, Mama? Put a ticket for Ashley to put the sandwich in. Oh, I just said that. We, we oh, like for put, put the sandwich back in there. Oh yeah, put, <clears throat> when you make the, your kids' sandwiches. Um, you can definitely put it back inside of there. And then also, do you put chips in there? You put, like, chips. No, you can put, like... No, I just put a sandwich in. Oh, the sandwich? Your sandwich? Yeah. And what, else? what about his wraps? What else? Blueberries. Mm -hmm. I got you a can, little old plastic that I put those You can wash these, too, and put them in there, because that'll be good, too, right? Yeah. <clears throat> and stack them. I like the fact that they stackable. So, yeah, that's some ideas from me and Mom, even though you can't see her. She's here. She's talking to y'all. Um, and that is good because I'll be trying to get mama on camera, but that ain't going to happen. Mm -mm. Um, so we got my son's favorite um, sea salt veggie straws. Um, and this is also the Good Gather brand as well. Just have potatoes and veggies, vegetable sticks. And it is less, 30% less on the fat. And so instead of regular chips, we give him these right here. My son loves, loves, loves them veggie sticks. So anytime I see them at Target's, they used to didn't have them. They had them, and then they took them away. And I guess maybe people was complaining about them. So they start bringing them back. Um, so anytime I see them, I grab some for him. <clears throat> Got some Gala, Gala apples from Good & Gather as well. And they look so pretty. Um, I do encourage everybody not to just take them out and cut them up and put in your, your kids' lunch thing. Make sure you take them out and wash them because they do have like, I was reading up on different things and they have like, <clears throat> you don't never know, like people from the, the plant say that they wash them and stuff like that. Just like with your vegetables, if it's already say like salads and stuff, it's pre-washed, definitely go back in and wash your stuff because don't trust nobody with your food okay and especially as yeah a lot of dirt and, and pesticides and especially as stores people touch 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 y'all already know so you don't know yup strawberries anything else mom these blueberries <laughs> i'm gonna tell you when we was at all this little story little fun time real real quick y'all we was me and my son was at all this that um y'all seen at all these hall but my, me and my son was at Aldi's, and some lady was grabbing grapes. <laughs> grabbing grapes. And, I mean, she was really eating them. And then she, I was, like, looking like, them grapes are not washed. They dirty. And she was eating, them, eating the grapes and then putting them back. Like, she put the whole thing back. She took some off and then. But. <clears throat> she was all behind. Yeah. But, um. 
I wish I had a new. I would have got her some of them grapes, though, because she was eating them, but I didn't really think about it. But, yeah, make sure you wash all your veggies and your fruits and stuff. Um, I'm going to tell you, I got a pet peeve. When I be watching YouTube and I be seeing these parents, these mamas, ain't none of my business to each his own, each his own home. <sighs> they be taking, like, these blueberries and stuff. I be watching them, and they'll just take them out and put them in, like, the little Ziploc bag and send their kids off. Or they be just take them, put them in a little Ziploc bag, and and don't even wash them. I'm just like, that's just nasty. And then you wonder why the kids are sick. We wonder why you sick. But to each his own home, I ain't got nothing to do with that. But in this house, in my mama house, in my house, I wash everything. Meats too. But anywho, let's keep going. Let's keep pushing. Um, I got some of this Good and Gather organic 100% canola oil. I've never tried this. I know I'm gonna try to go for the olive oil, but I wanted to try this because it's organic. So I went ahead and got that. All right, so these are the Can Alani's uh, juice peach energy drinks that I love to drink myself. I got my sister hooked on them. They are so good. Don't not do not sleep on Alani because this is real, Mama. That's embarrassing. But that's okay, because we all family here. We all family, don't be. That's sad. <laughs> well, I had, I had to it out oh, my goodness. That's... Mama. I had to go. Scales, baby. <laughs> what you say? Kid. See, that's a good thing about it. You can cuss on my channel. But I wouldn't, because I have... I, I have... Uh, I said, Chit. Kids. I Watch it with their fans. Chit. Chit. Chitlins. <laughs> so, yes, I be having these, like, before work. Um, and, they, and when I tell you, give you energy, it ain't like it just give you that booming energy. But it do give you energy to, you know, stay focused throughout the, you know, throughout a couple of hours. Um, but they really good. Um... Put them on some uh, crushed ice. Oh, I'm done. So I was up there at the counter and I saw some of these. They had some of these and I just got one pack of these because I want to try them. I love me some peanut butter crackers, but I thought that they, um, I don't, to be honest, I don't like these. I like the yellow ones, but they had these up there and they was, I don't know. I forgot how much they were. I think it was like some cents. Um, yeah, and I got this, but they was like in... You know, uh, I've never seen them. I don't know if your uh, Target has these um, at the front, but they was like in this little bin thing. I don't know if somebody just left them there or what, but I don't even know if the lady charged me for these, to be honest, because I've never seen these at the front, but i seen they had a couple of these at the front, so they probably was in a little, some kind of little uh, markdown, and they just hadn't marked them down yet. <laughs> All right, and I got some peanut butter. Y'all, I'm not a fan of peanut butter and jelly, but I am a fan. Like, I would have a piece of bread with some peanut butter on it and other piece of bread with some jelly. I do not put them together. I do not. No, no, no. They cannot be a couple. <laughs> they cannot be best friends and they cannot be sisters and brothers. <laughs> they cannot be closed. Um, but I toast my bread. I put peanut butter on one side because I love warm peanut butter. And then I put jelly on the other side. And... Let me tell y'all about the prices of jelly. Ooh, we, honey. Jelly, jelly, jelly. <laughs> I'm sorry, jelly, but I had to leave you there. Okay, so Target's had a, a little old sale on their brand, the Good and Gather brand of jelly. It was uh, for strawberry jelly, it was $2.19, and for grape jelly, it was $3.18. I'm just like, I definitely ain't for the spin at $2.19 on no strawberry jelly, which I don't really. I like strawberry jelly, but I don't eat it all the time. Now, grape jelly, I will turn me some grape jelly up, but I'm just not willing to pay that much for jelly. Now, when I find it on sale somewhere, I definitely will get me a couple of them and call it a day. But until then, I just got the Get and Gather Creamy Peanut Butter. Um, and I like to pair this peanut butter with honey. You can also buy peanut butter with the honey inside of it as well. Um, and it's really, really good. I got some of the Good and Gather Graduated Sugar. 
Um, this is the four pound bag or four lab bag ounces or whatever. Then I got back here three boxes of instant brown rice. So yes, I got three boxes of brown rice because I'm switching from white rice to brown rice. I think it's a more healthier um, option. Um, I got the Target spread good and gather. So for my meals, I'm not sure what I'm gonna have with these brown rices. Um, but mom, you got any ideas? Yes, we have uh, fried rice with broccoli and grilled chicken and carrots. Okay, so fried fried rice. My mama also put me onto these rices. How many? How many? How much? Like this is one meal or what? How much? Two meals. Two meals? Yeah. Okay, so two meals. You can use this box for two meals. Um, so you say grilled chicken, rice, fried rice. You, grill, you fry your rice and you grill your chicken. And you uh, grill your broccoli and your carrots. Okay. Can you... So I can... And then also I can have baked chicken as well with rice and some kind of side like green beans. Um, so yeah, that that's that sounds good to me. Or if y'all into, I'm about to start stop eating like any type of red meat myself. I'm gonna stick with like ground turkey and turkey, period, and chicken. Uh, but like steak and stuff like that, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna cut turkey on it. So, um, can you have like meatballs with it? Yes. Okay. Cause I do want to make some of them. I want to make some like sweet and sour meatballs, or make a burrito bowl with it. That'd be a great option too as well, especially if you're crunch for time. A burrito bowl with like meat and veggies, something like that. Fiesta rice. <laughs> fiesta rice. What is fiesta rice? My mama laughing at me, y'all, cause I said I don't know what fiesta rice is, but what is it? Mama, is it like, I'm done with my mama right now. Y'all, y'all, I see that back there. It's Sephora. But that's going to be in the next video because I definitely won't have time because I'm moving slow with this um, haul, this grocery haul. And we couldn't up with mama today. So, yeah. So, I did get some of this um, butter and herb rice uh, pasta roni. I think I had this before, but I'm not sure if I had it, had it. But, um, cause I can't even tell you how it tastes, but I think I did buy it and maybe I bought it from Walmart and they got substituted for something else. We had it with chicken. We had it with chicken? Baked chicken. Baked chicken. Yes, we did. Cause my mama made it. Okay. So yes, I did. We had that last time I was at mama's house and it was with this and baked chicken she had. <clears throat> and then we got some of these oven ready lasagna cause that's exactly what it's going to be four, y'all. My mama taught me how to make lasagna the easy way. Mama, how you make lasagna? Look, I know recipes. You sure right. We're not giving out no recipes and no seasoning ingredients. You don't give me no recipe anyway. I have to figure it out my own. Also, I came across this. This Seco Arzo rice um so it's like a pasta rice and i want to try it and see how it tastes if i don't like it then i don't like it um i'll probably give it to my sister because my sister my sister likes to make like ramen soup and stuff like this so that'll go good with what she having then i came across this um these star kiss what i call tuna this is my favorite the one with the sunflower oil my mom get it. I get it. Like, we be getting them. And sometimes they don't be having them on hand. So, I just say whatever. But when they do have these, I tend to try to get them because sometimes I be wanting tuna. Um, it just depends. <clears throat> so, I did pick up two pack of the pink salmon. Um... And normally you would make like, what is it? Salmon croquette with these. But I like to make salmon wraps um, and put like, le like lettuce, 
cilantro, tomato, cucumber, stuff like that for a quick wrap. It's really good. Um, and also at Target's, I forgot to get it. They have this pita, like these low carb pita thins, and they are so good with the tuna. I think I showed you guys before I had made like a um, chipotle tuna or something like that on my little um, thin bread. And it was so good. So I want to try this on that. I need to get back into eating salmon because I do got like two fresh pieces of salmon at home and have not even cooked them. I have not cooked them yet. Um, then we got some potatoes. I try to go for the big potatoes because they last pretty long. Um, and I don't have to worry about buying more potatoes. Um, I bought my son. So for my keto... I got Ashton some of this Mondo uh, paint. It's just a two full ounce. And this is in the color of, which is very, very pretty, hot chili pepper. Um, and this is a satin finish. He needed some. Um, and then I got him the Mondo paint brushes. And then... We need a little bit of, uh, go ahead and so, tell them what I got from Target. So, what's this? I'm taking over this show, and today, <laughs> that's my kiddo. Now I'm going to take over the show. You said you're going to so, take over the show? The show? I said the channel. You said the show. I said the channel. Okay, we're going to play it back. Fine. Channel or show? Show. Channel. Channel. It's just a okay. channel. Okay. okay. That, not so, this. Not this part. We already went over this part. Now we got to go over just these, for these, these, this item. So what did I get? So she got some laundry detergent right here, and then I mean, what kind of you gotta say? What kind? You can't just say some laundry detergent right here. You gotta say this some original four in one laundry detergent packs. These then, are the pots. And then you got. Okay. Wait a minute. Older, then you have to. Odor blasters. But you didn't even tell them how many pods they you get. get. You get. You didn't say they was compared to gang flings or nothing. They get, they, and they are the cheaper version. They are up and up. They targets brand. And they're better. And they're better. So hold on, wait a minute. But you ain't even tell them how much odor blasters was it. You, got the you didn't even say almond um, hammer, odor um, blasters, and wash scent boosters. The scent of fresh burst. Church. It eliminates tough Church. odors from funky socks, musty Church. towels, and sweaty clothes. She's the one that need it. I don't need it. Baby, them. Ooh, honey, let's not get into it. Let's not. Don't try to don't try to uh, cap on the camera. Bye, babe. Look. No. Anywho, we got some good deals on these uh, containers here. Why, why when I'm trying to film something, where you come? Because I can. Because you can. Oop, doop, 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 Y'all kids these days. And I mean kids. Well, I only got one, so kid. Let's just correct that. Um, I got these two cute, minimal uh, containers. These are like a pretty gray and when I saw this, I was like, this is right up my alley. And I needed these in my life. Like, I needed them. I need these to put my sugar and my flour in. And inside here, I like this pretty uh, top that's on top. But it's got, like, a lot of room in there. Um, so I could put, you could put flour sugar in there. You could put odds and end pieces in there. You could put flowers in there. My mama, she probably will put flowers in her. That's why I'm trying to watch them closely because she she been having her eyes on them for a minute. So I did get these in the clearance section. They going to tell me that they was not on clearance when they was in the clearance section. So the lady wound up giving it to me um, for five, $5 a piece. I believe that they were 19 a piece, which I know I, I don't know about nobody else, but 
these, I, no, I'm not going to pay no $19 for each one of them. And then also, I did buy, they had like four of them. So I did buy the other two, but they are sitting somewhere over there. Because ain't nobody got time to be carrying all this stuff. So that's why I got two over here. And there's two over there where I was sitting at. <clears throat> then also came across this pretty aesthetic flower pot. This is exactly what this is. It's flower pot. And as you can see, it does have like little stains on it. And the lady said that because it was outside, they keep uh, some of that stuff outside. Um, that I could have it for, you know, less of the value. And I went to look inside of there. Obviously, they was using it. So I was like, honestly, it should be free because y'all was using it and y'all left it out there. And I was honestly looking for a flower for my mom, y'all. I was looking for my, my mom a, a nice little flower. And that's how I came up on this little cut right here. Um, but she gave this to me for like $2. And I gave her like $2. And I think she just like, you know, slid it right on in her pocket. But, um, yes, to each his own. I mean, she gave it to me on a good discount. I took it and ran with it. So she put that money in her pocket. She put her money in that pocket. Now, mama's sitting right there. I know that even though I couldn't find her none, y'all, mama probably going to take this. I won't see this. Um, so that's that. So anyways, you guys, that's the end of this Target haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed mom's voice because she ain't going to get on her. Um, I need to put this stuff that I'm leaving here with Ashley in mom's refrigerator. Um, but other than that, y'all, today has been a lovely day. I hope you guys are doing well in y'all neck of the woods. Make sure if you made it this far to go ahead and subscribe. What are you waiting for? We vibing over here. We doing good over here. Um, so go ahead and subscribe. Become family. Um, go ahead and share us out to good vibing people. And also leave a comment in the comment section below. Give us a big thumbs up. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.